Hi everyone, Jeff Cote here with BoatingTechTalk.com. Thanks for joining us today. We've got a fellow boater, Jonathan, who's got a Sun Odyssey 45 sailing yacht out of the Netherlands. Jonathan, thanks for sending a question our way. Jonathan asks, Jeff, installing three new batteries in my battery bay. Okay, I don't have much clearance above the batteries. Yeah, that's actually quite, quite common. We're trying to jam as much stuff as we can in boats and sometimes the batteries are pretty high. And stacking the interconnecting cables on the main post is creating a tight fit. Okay, good one. Okay, that happens. My new batteries also have a second threaded post. Can I use those for parallel connections in the bank? Jonathan, when I saw this question land in my inbox, I knew I was going to answer this. So thanks for asking. The short answer is yes. Okay, all right, let's go into now. Why? It's common. And not always, but there are certain batteries that actually have two battery posts per side, meaning two battery posts on the positive, two battery posts on the negative. One is going to be an automotive post, which almost looks like a thumb. It's basically something that you put a clamp on and you see that in a lot of cars. And that's why it's called an automotive post. And there's another post that is a threaded post. And that's where you actually, uh, through compression with a bolt, actually are able to fasten sort of lugs. So it's some batteries actually have both. They have an automotive post and a marine post. And the question is, can I use both? Yes, you can actually. They're both connected to the battery. And in this instance, I would always, of course, recommend to use only one post. But hey, if you've got, it's a non-option, why not use both? And I've seen it and I've done it. So no problem, Jonathan, in using the lower post, which is going to be the marine one, to do your interconnection. And then use maybe the automotive post with that little adapter that rises, that, that makes the battery taller, and use that to go to your positive distribution. So Jonathan, totally doable. I've done it. And that is the advantage of having a battery with two positive and two negative posts, one being automotive and the other one being positive. So thanks for asking. Thank you for watching this PYS video. If you've got further questions, please ask them below or send us an email via the contact forms on our website. Happy to donate my time to share information with you. You can support us in keeping this channel ad-free by purchasing some merchandise on our store or by making a donation on PayPal. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again for watching.